Monte Carlo, the beginning of a legend in 1970, designed and engineered for the discriminating driver, a unique personal luxury car at the time, and its time was right. But needs and expectations have changed, and America's affordable mid-size luxury car has more than kept pace. Today, it's still a breed apart. The 1981 Monte Carlo, value you can count on. Monte Carlo is totally restyled for 1981. Its clean, lean, new look extends from bumper to bumper, beginning with a classic redesigned grille and dual horizontal headlamp treatment, a new highly protective soft fascia bumper and rectangular parking lamps, and a sleek sloping hood for impressive forward visibility. Striking elegance is continued in Monte Carlo's side profile, recessed front and rear side marker lamps, with new standard wide bright metal rocker panel moldings that run the entire length of the car. And a new opera style window. The all new crisp rear styling includes a dramatic deck lid that extends nearly to the bumper for a convenient low lift over height. Tailored vertical tail lamp treatments and a new integrated stylish and highly protective soft fascia bumper complete Monte Carlo's new rear appearance. Monte Carlo Landau features such luxurious appointments as a fully padded vinyl top on the rear portion of the roof. That completely surrounds the opera window, which is framed in chrome. Contrasting accent pinstriping, dual sport mirrors, specific bright molding along the door and across the hood. And new this year is an optional aluminum wheel, exclusive for Monte Carlo. The new Monte Carlo and Monte Carlo Landau, efficiently styled for today's driving environment. The value of Monte Carlo's handsome body by Fisher Engineering is more than skin deep with extensive anti-corrosion measures that will help keep your Monte Carlo looking good. The use of zinc-rich pre-coated steel helps resist rust. Hot melt wax spray and sealers help keep air and moisture from attacking critical metal areas. The inner fender liners help channel water and road splash from metal surfaces. A zinc-rich primer and three coats of acrylic paint are applied for a beautiful protective finish. Elegance and style extend to Monte Carlo's interior. Distinctive door trim. A stylish steering wheel with rich simulated wood grain accents. A restyled instrument panel. Plush cut pile carpeting. A standard full foam cushion front bench seat in rich upholstered cloth or vinyl. The interior design efficiency of Monte Carlo gives enough room for six to ride comfortably with plenty of head and leg room in both the front and back seat. And inside Monte Carlo Landau, shown here with optional custom interior, is a new reflection of personal luxury. With Landau's standard 55-45 split bench front seat with center folding armrest, offered in cloth or vinyl upholstery. And distinctive new door and quarter trim. Further personalize your Monte Carlo with a wide range of comfort and convenience options. GM Delco sound systems for listening pleasure. Comfort tilt steering wheel that adjusts to six positions for driving comfort. Automatic speed control with a resume speed feature, especially convenient if you do a lot of highway driving. Power windows, door locks, and trunk release for convenience and security. Because of the new deck lid design, the 1981 Monte Carlo provides 17 cubic feet of trunk space. That's a full cubic foot more than last year. Monte Carlo's ride corresponds to its new looks. Smooth, luxurious, and maneuverable. The full perimeter frame has 14 tuned rubber body mounts to help isolate the passengers from road vibrations. And new for Monte Carlo this year, higher pressure radial ply tires that contribute to a lower rolling resistance. Computer-selected full-coil springs tuned to the higher-pressure tires help deliver a smooth ride. Newly designed hydraulic front and rear shock absorbers and the standard front stabilizer bar aids maneuverability, especially on turns. All help make Monte Carlo the precise, balanced, maneuverable automobile you expect while maintaining its traditionally smooth ride. The driving pleasure of Monte Carlo is further enhanced with standard power steering and standard power front disc brakes and power assisted rear drum brakes. For a more firm, sporty ride, the optional F41 sports suspension package is available on both the 1981 Coupe and Landau models. The choice is yours. 
Monte Carlo standard suspension for the solid, smooth, comfortable ride of a true luxury road car. Or choose the F41 sports suspension option for a firm driver's car feel. Chevrolet, value you can count on. Monte Carlo's luxury is combined with impressive operating economy. First, a variety of efficient engines are available, beginning with the spirited standard 3.8 liter V6, engineered for impressive fuel economy. Or choose the 3.8 liter turbocharged V6. The turbocharger kicks in for a quick response power boost when you need it. And yet, when cruising at normal highway speeds, delivers the fuel economy of a V6. Also optional is an efficient 4.4 liter V8. Monte Carlo, under normal operating conditions, offers extended recommended maintenance intervals that can save you time and money, like automatic transmission fluid that need only be changed every 100,000 miles, and spark plug changes up to 30,000 miles, are another way Chevrolet adds to Monte Carlo's operating economy. And keep in mind the added benefit of having your new Monte Carlo serviced by a nationwide network of Chevrolet dealers. Wherever you travel, you're never too far from Chevrolet. We'd now like to take you on a demonstration drive in a new Monte Carlo. In another step forward in advanced technology, all 1981 Chevrolets equipped with gasoline engines will feature the remarkable new computer command control system. This system reduces exhaust emissions to the lowest level in Chevrolet's history. While at the same time, our objective is to strive for the highest average fuel economy in Chevrolet Motor Division history. The heart of the system is a reliable microprocessor, an onboard computer that continually monitors information from as many as six sensors on throttle position, manifold vacuum, oxygen readings, engine temperature, engine speed, and vehicle speed. The computer then processes this information and makes adjustments to as many as six different systems, such as the carburetor fuel system, the ignition system, the transmission converter clutch, and the emission control systems. Making thousands of calculations per second, the computer command control system is adjusting the engine as you drive. In fact, the computer can actually make up to 10 carburetor adjustments per second, allowing the carburetor to be precise in maintaining the proper balance of fuel and air entering the cylinders. And the system automatically adjusts the timing as engine parts wear. It also compensates for changes in altitude and barometric pressure. That means cars start quickly, run smoothly. The system is so well designed that it and other emission control systems are backed by a five-year, 50,000-mile warranty. And it's self-diagnostic. A service technician, using the instrument panel warning light, a voltmeter, and the repair manual, can easily service the computer command control system. From now on, you'll activate a computer when you step on the gas. Chevrolet is working hard to bring you a great combination, clean air and good gas mileage. For 1981, all conventional rear-wheel drive gasoline-powered Chevrolets with automatic transmission are equipped with a torque converter clutch. The torque converter is a very important and integral part of every automatic transmission because it transfers and multiplies engine torque. A torque converter spins and it is this spinning that generates torque and power multiplication. This spinning is desirable for quick acceleration or when passing slower moving vehicles, both high torque requirements. When the vehicle reaches a specific speed in high gear, the torque requirements are low. The torque converter clutch automatically couples the torque converter into a one-to-one -one ratio. The action provides a direct mechanical linkage between the drive shaft and the engine, thus preventing fuel-wasting slippage.